Welcome to our final round recap of the third Carolinian Amateur from Keith Hills Country Club. It was an action-packed day, so let's get right into it. Zach Swanson, the leader after 36 holes, did not hold on to his lead after some mistakes throughout the round, including a double bogey on the hole number eight that set him back for good. The hometown favorite, Amarin Kravixen, was one of the players to make a push throughout the day. He ended with a clean scorecard, was able to total five birdies, and sank this putt on the par 5 18th to seal a playoff with Harry Reynolds. Reynolds was able to storm into the playoff, shooting a total eight under on the day. He was able to secure nine total birdies and only one bogey to put himself at minus nine for the round. Reynolds continued to make shot after shot and climb the leaderboard all the way to the top. On the third playoff hole, both Reynolds and Kravixen drove it in the fairway to start the hole. They both then used short irons to get it about 30 feet from the pin. Kravixen would go on to miss his putt and Reynolds would then drill the winning putt the first time CGA champion would go on to talk about his round after play. Well, it kind of came back to my putter today, and I was really putting it well, and um, really went out there with no expectations. Just went out and go, tried to have a tried to have a good third round, and it really started going for me. and And I knew if I just kept going, kept kept it going, it would I'd have a good chance. Um, I hit a, my approach shot a little bit too far. I had about 30 feet coming down the hill and made that one. Um, so I knew if I gave myself a, a good chance, I, I could do it. Well, it hasn't quite sank in yet, but it's a great feeling. Um, obviously, going into the day, it never really crossed my mind, to be honest, and, and uh, it's, it's a great feeling.